I will review this frame after being testing it for three years. Before I start, I want to make clear that I am not being sponsored, either receiving any kind of compensation from the frame factory. I will show the frame options, specifications, pro and cons and final considerations about it. Stay with me. If you are thinking about building your custom bike, the frame is one of the most important and critical parts to be considered. It will define your bike and set the parameters for all parts. Before getting in this frame specifications, let's see what are the frame options. First option. If you have advanced welding, metalworking and fabrication skills and the proper tools, you can design and build your frame from the scratch. Second option. Buy a high quality frame to add your parts on it. This is the easiest way, but not much room for customization. Third option. Customize a pre-built frame to match your needs. This was my choice. Choose a good frame to work with. You will need some construction skills, but less than building the whole frame. Warning. Keep in mind that the frame warranty may be violated with structural modifications. Frame details. This frame is made by Rough Cycles. It is a solid company based in Regensburg, Germany. When I bought this frame, back in 2014, they were specialized in frames fabrications. They sell premium quality frames. Very well designed and with a lifetime warranty. Nowadays they offer a lot more than only frames, they are building one of the most desirable electric bicycle in the market, the Ruffian. Rough Cycles offers a wide range of frames to your choice. This review is about the Smyans frame. Let's take a look at the frame specifications. It is a low seat frame. Very long, and the bike will ride very close to the floor. This frame will accept the rim sizes of 24 inches or 26 inches and 65 mm, 80 mm or 100 mm width. The bottom bracket type is US BMX. Head tube 1 1 8 of an inch, 155 mm length with the rake angle of 45 degrees. The seat post base is 31.8 mm. Brake mounts. Fits disc and coaster brakes. Perhaps, some small adaptations will be necessary, depending on the chosen parts. The frame is unpainted, raw, but the company offers a powder coating service. You can pick any color you like. It will cost you around 100 euros extra and a little longer to receive the goods. The distance of the seat tube to head tube is approximately 780 mm, according to the producer it should be enough for people above 190 cm tall. The distance of the seat tube to bottom bracket is approximately 640 mm. The frame is made of steel approximately 1,400 mm long, and weighs 6.6 .6 kg. Time to talk about the pros and cons of this frame. Pros. Very well built and solid frame. The welded joints are very well done, and practically disappear after painting the frame. It is designed to fit and accept all available parts of the market. You don't need to buy special parts to build your bike on it. Perfect aligned and straight. Modern and aggressive design. Easy to customize. As there are many free areas, and it is made of steel, you can easily make changes, and add your custom elements, as tanks, fenders, engines, lights and a lot more. High quality steel. It offers great elasticity and resistance. Ergonomy. Very comfortable for short distances and daily commute. The low seat position, makes very easy to reach the ground and hold the bike if necessary. Very good for city rides and flat areas. No holes or cable holders. You can customize the cableways as you desire. Lifetime guarantee. Cons. The lower part is actually very low, between 10 and 12 centimeters from the floor. It can be quite frustrating for some riders. The 45 degrees head tube, depending on the selected forks combination, can make the bike turning a bit heavy. Despite having holes for rear brake, some adaptation might be necessary. It depends on the chosen parts. No holes or cable holders. You will have to make holes or design your own cable holders. My final considerations. I do recommend this frame for experienced bikes builders, as well for those who will be building the first bike ever. The producer offers a great customer service and very fast delivery. At the time I'm doing this video, the retail price is 329.95 euros. I'll place my links in the video description below. You never know when these things might go on sales. Don't expect to perform very long rides within this frame. Considering the very low bottom tube, this frame ain't the best option for countryside riders. 
This frame is so reliable that I'm planning a new build very soon. I'd like to build an electric bicycle using a Rough Cycles aluminum frame. Hopefully, if it ever happens I want to record a step-by-step -step video, and later another product review. I hope this video will help your purchase decision. If you have any questions concerning this frame, feel free to contact me.